It is now April. April. So today it's um, the first river outing that we've done actually. I mean, we attempted one, didn't we? That failed epically when I ended up in the water. We don't talk about that. We don't talk about that now. Um, so this is our first river outing. We're just going to try and see how far we can go, basically. So we're in Goring. Goring? The beautiful Goring and Stradley. Significantly slower flow than the last time we attempted a river sub. Mm. Less ice as well. Less ice? Yeah, no ice to break. It is slower, isn't it? Significant. <laughs> Absolutely significant. Did you just say, am I happy? Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually genuinely quite nervous. It's so weird. It's not even cold today. The river's not even flowing fast. And my heart's like... Woo! Back on the Thames. Beautiful, beautiful. One kilometre down the river. My heart rate has finally calmed down. In fact, I wonder what it was. I have to have a look at my Garmin. But I'm pretty sure it was high. <laughs> and now I feel positively relaxed. It's just a nice little house behind you. <laughs> There's a big boat coming our way. So that's annoying. It's a fucking yacht. There's a yacht on the River Thames. And here comes the wake. I'm gonna sit down, I'm gonna sit down, I'm freaking out. <laughs> I just totally freaked out. I had to sit down. <laughs> oh, I'm going towards the tree again, <laughs> My heart rate, my heart rate's back up. That lasted all of half an hour. <laughs> What have you spotted, Chris? There appears to be some kind of smoke, and as the saying goes, where there is smoke, there is fire. So just gonna you know, have a look, see if the tree's about to burn down. Basically, someone's had a camp here, left a fire burning next to some rather dead wood on the hottest day of the year so far. Clever. It's a nice spot. Lovely spot for a Lovely campfire. Spot, but it's still going, there's some heat coming off that bad boy. Woo, very hot. Should we start with the old? All right, let's see. Um... Oh my God, the tree's literally on fire. <laughs> Contemplating calling the fire brigade. We've done what we can. No, we can't. They're not going to do any more than no. the one we can do with another few. I think they might do better than. Okay, they might have more sophisticated <laughs> equipment. But. Hmm. I think it's uh, pretty much there. I don't think it's going to relight. You don't think we need to ring 999? No, I'd be surprised if it's going to relight. A few more buckets. That's a good one. A bit for the environment. <laughs> Chris just uh, put the fire out once and for all. <laughs> Are you just going to step off? <laughs> he thought about it then, he thought One day that. I will get that down. How clear it is. We've crunched some numbers. <laughs> we've got the spreadsheet out and we're looking good. We're looking good. We seem to be paddling at four kilometers per hour. Pretty decent, isn't it? So it's still, still 10 hours a day we have to paddle. To make 40K. 10 hours, hour break for lunch. Start at six. So we're um, trying our latest uh, invention in the stand-up paddleboarding world, and that is sitting down. It's all right. It's all right. You can get on board with it. I mean, S-U-P. Sit under the paddle. There we go. 
So keeping us hydrated on our sup trip is our Grail Press water bottles. And uh, we're now gonna do a little experiment. Can we do this whilst on the river? Step one, fill up the outside container. <laughs> okay, river water filled up. And now press down on it to filter that glorious river water into the bottom. This is meant to use your whole body weight, so I need to. I'm doing it. Oh my god, I'm glad you've done it. Look at this. This is on the go water filtration, people. So fresh and so clean, clean. Ooh, fresh and clean. There we go. That is. Water filtration whilst on the river. Oh, yeah. Chris is determined to investigate. What does it say? It's an emergency bloodline. <laughs> it's really cool. I've got to pick it up. It's stuck down. <laughs> I reckon you've totally been fooled here. You've been had. Oh, where's the camera? <laughs> Do you think it's a pun on the fact that when the river floods, you know, that you put the emergency line floodline? It's a pun! On the line where the flood comes up to. So this is an emergency floodline. Yes! Very clever. How far have we come? 23 kilometers. That's 3k up on last time, isn't it? Ooh, Ooh. pat us on the little back. Yeah, so we set off today just being like, right, we're just gonna go as far as we can. I could go further, to be fair, but the sun is going. That's, that's useful, because we will need to go further <laughs> for, for seven days. Just FYI, I could do yeah. double that. Um, no, we did all right. Uh, we what, did that in what, like seven hours? And that was including firefighting. <laughs> so, um, I reckon you could knock an hour and a half out of that. I, I think you could knock two off. And lunch. And look, because we had lunch yeah. as well. I reckon you could knock two hours yeah. <laughs> off that, which makes 23K in five, five hours. hours. So, double that, 10 hours a day paddling. 10 hours paddling and plus pub lunches. Easy. Easy. This is what we say at we the say end of every video. video. <laughs> and that's what we need to do. Easy. Easy. <laughs> Did you get it? <laughs> <laughs>